We are not the same. God has some are apostles, some are prophets, some are evangelists, some are pastors, some are teachers. You know, all the reason is to equip the saints for the work of the ministry. In order to edify the body of Christ, not to fight with each other, not to compete with each other. The church has to have all those people. And my job is to, you know, to bring those people up. Mm -hmm. Two main problems. There's some people, you see what they have, and then when you you want them to practice what they have, and some, some other people, they are ready, really, but you are ready, they are there, but they don't want to step up. Every time, when you, you, you tell them to do something, no, 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 not today, not today. And some of them, they started even doing some things, and then they back. Mm -hmm. if, you, if you disposition yourself, you'll be replaced. Yeah. That is the warning. If you don't do your, your work, mm -hmm. if you, you, you don't want to be a handwork, God will not contend with you. God will find somebody else, put their palm. You remember King Saul? He rebelled against God. And God, I mean, he replaced him. When he was still called a king, another king has been anointed. If you want to do anything, please follow the guidance. Like there are some other people, they are not ready. They have a meaning like a ministry. There's some other ministries very sensitive. The things with the things of God and this ministration, you need to, to be trained and undergo the process. There's some things you need to know before you start that ministry. You need to have the anointing to stand on that. So you need to be led. There's some people who don't know themselves. You need to ask God. And then that thing which you see God has placed in your heart to do. You know, you know we have to teach you, I mean, how to do it. You know, there's a lot of things. May the Lord help us. Amen.